Hello, Spirit and Life Church family and friends. Today we were talking about spiritual gifts, but now let's think about spiritual gift of administration. One of the many gifts of the Holy Spirit to his church is administration. It is sometimes overlooked, but it is important at all of the other spiritual gifts. 1 Corinthians 12, 28 and Romans 12, 8, both include the gift of administration in their list of spiritual gifts. It is called administering in the English Standard Version and other translations have given it the title leadership or governments. Administration is considered a team gift because it thrives when called upon to organize people to accomplish an objective. God gives some the spiritual gift of administration in order to help organize those with other gifts and keep the church functioning at its most efficient best. We see this in Moses. Moses' gifts are shown as he assembles the people of God as they confront Pharaoh. And Moses is, has organized the people so that they know that they can trust him because he has put his trust in God. And so we know the story of the people of Israel who were in bondage in Egypt and relied upon on Moses to give them what they needed to encourage them and to rally them so that they actually could leave Egypt and go to the promised land. And we see once they leave Egypt on their way to the promised land, Moses brings them together and reminds them that God is with them. And we know that Moses went up to Mount Sinai and received the Ten Commandments from God and brings them Ten Commandments down to the people so that they understand what God wants for their lives. So Moses has the skills to be able to rally the people, organize them, encourage them, show them the pathway that God is leading them. And we know that Moses, as one of the great leaders, of the Hebrew people stands out as a great administrator in his role in leading the people of Israel. Moses was not perfect. He listened to God, but then when he didn't listen to God, God mentioned to him and told Moses that he would not enter the promised land. So the people, as you know, wandered for 40 years and Moses led them through most of those efforts to continue to strengthen them, encourage them, uplift them so that they would see what God had for them. So this gift of administration is very important and seen in strong leadership. And so today we want to lift up the gift of administration and how it lights up the lives of the church the church builds and is edified by the gift of administration. It's a leadership gift, and it's a gift that is important in keeping the congregation rallied, encouraged, and most important, leads the people in the direction. So with all the other spiritual gifts in mind, this administration gift is a leadership gift that actually is the hallmark of leaders in the church. So thank you and God bless you. And remember, this gift of leadership is often seen in pastors, deacons, and other laity. And it's one of the very, very strong gifts that we consider for leading in the church. God bless you until we meet again.